Jackie and today I've got a Michael's haul to show you. There's so much stuff on clearance you guys. How come no one told me? I would have gone sooner. It was so picked over. <laughs> but um, I did see a few things on some other people's videos and that's why I ended up going and I managed to find everything I was looking for and plus a bunch of other stuff. So um, first I'll show you the regular price stuff I got and then everything else I got is on clearance and I'll show you that next. So um, just in the little cheapy bins uh, I picked up some twine, $1.50. And there was 30% off your entire regular price, your regular purchase price, or your regular, your entire regular purchase. Um, so that was a dollar basically. And then these were a dollar fifty, and I got them in silver too. So they came out to a dollar each, and you get three of each letter, so or three of the vowels, two of the consonants. So that seems good. Um, I saw these labels on somebody else's video, and they just looked so great. Um, so I got those, and I think they were these were three fifty. So. They would have been like a dollar twenty off or something, so probably like two thirty. Um, and they're Recollections brand labels, and there's looks like two sheets, three sheets, four sheets of that kind, and four sheets of that kind. This is the reason I bought it. I just love these labels, and I need more labels. Um, so I won't open the other one since there's two styles. Uh, this one came with these ones, which I thought it cut in half. They'd be adorable, and. Um, Actually, I will take this out of the package if I can figure out how to open it. <laughs> and this is what the other sheet looks like and just really nice rainbow spring colors. So again, four sheets of each design. And um, so then in the Valentine's clearance, I saw this in somebody else's video and I just, normally I wouldn't buy a kit like this, but I really like all the elements in it. So this is the Recollections Valentine's Day stamp card kit, 37 pieces. And inside it comes with this adorable stamp set. Oh, I guess it's all sealed. Um, let's open it up. Crinkle, crinkle. It comes with this really cute stamp set um, that, you know, the Valentine's greetings, whatever. Um, but I love the little gem on it. I like the word love on it, the XOs, and these little hearts are just, they make the cutest little, you know, they can make a little trail of hearts. It'd be so cute. So I thought that was a great little stamp set. And then the cards, it looks like actually they're cutout cards. I just thought they were, you know, you can never go wrong with black and white stripes. And it looks like it's actually like a cutout. And then there's, what's this inside? And then a red piece of cardstock folded inside. So the idea is you make your own card out of it. And then it also comes with some gold embossing powder, a little tin of that, um, and then a little adhesive stamp uh, stamp pad, and then a tiny, tiny acrylic block. And that would be cute for like planner stamps or for travel. So that was, I forgot to mention, I think it was $649, $679. And that was a sale price, not a clearance price. Um, and then a ton of the Tim Holtz stuff was on sale. Um, and the Dilutions, like the stamp and Stencils kits. Mine was mostly picked over, so the only things I picked up was this, st this stencil set. And um, this one was, I think, $549. $549? Uh, nope, that's not it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just checking my receipt. $499. And you get the alphabet on one side and you get the rulers on the other. And I really like the rulers. I think that's going to be cool. And then I picked up the craft tags were marked down to $1.99. And you can always use craft tags, right? Martha Stewart was also on clearance, like all the punches and stuff. But all I picked up was just this alpha, which I think was $3.49. Martha Stewart. No, I don't see it on my receipt. <laughs> Large glitter alpha, $3.49, yeah. So get lots in that pack. And it's really cute. Um, all the Heidi Swap mink stuff was on clearance. I just, I don't have a mink, but I was wondering if maybe this stuff would work with the deco foil. So I did pick up the teal and pink for $2.99. A ton of the Fabric Castell stuff was being cleared out, so I picked up a tub of gel medium because I'm running out of gel medium right now. I'm using the um, Liquitex brand and I don't love, love it. So um, I thought I'd try the Fabric Castell and this was $3.99. They also had like the glaze and the gesso and all that stuff was also marked down, but I have tons of that stuff. Oh, and the Valentine's, I picked up these sequins and they were like buck fifty nine because I just didn't have any gold or silver metallic. I only had gold and silver matte. Um, this washi tape was marked down to three ninety nine. You get two rolls and they are navy and pink and I just thought they were so pretty. I don't even remember seeing these when they were regular price, but they must have been there. I just never noticed them. 
Um, I picked up this ink pad. This is Encore Ultimate Metallic. I've never seen anyone in any videos using this. I have no idea if it's any good, but it is um, Sukineko brand, which is the same people that do Versamark. So I'm on the hunt for a good gold ink, so I thought I'd try this. It was like regular price $24 or something, but it was on for $5.49. So it seemed like a good idea. And then the last thing I got was one of these Heidi Swap Cinch album kits. And uh, I'm going to open this one up. Let me move this out of the way. Um, and it was marked down to, how much was it? $7.99. I want to say it was 20 something original. And inside you get, what's it say? Two chipboard covers, two white chipboard dividers, six clear acetate pages, one veneer wood word, two watercolor pages, one gold cinch coil. So let's take a look. Oh, I love this. <laughs> it's like ticket shaped. So the word that it came with was play and it's like a little wood veneer. This is the cover. Oh, it's really thick acetate. It's nice. Um, so one of those and these are the dividers. Yeah, they're pretty heavy. Oh, and even the um, acetate has tabs. I don't know if you can see that. It's like tabbed. And another divider. This one has like a frame around it. Uh, this one is just like a plain ticket, and that's chipboard. What's this? <laughs> Looks like they're like banners, although they would have to go in the book sideways, so I don't know what you're thinking here, Heidi. Um, so that one says smile, and this one says today. I'm so confused why they're sideways, but they don't fit in the book that way. I suppose I could always make it a landscape book. Well, I guess it depends on the size of the coil. Oh, and then there's this clear acetate banner as well. I almost didn't see that. And this is the coil, presumably. And it is long enough to do it portrait. Is that all in frame? Yeah, there we go. So yeah, that was the stuff I got. So I'm a little nervous how much they're clearing out at Michael's. Like, it's all, it seems like most of the good scrapping booking stuff is getting cleared out. So hopefully that means they're bringing in lots more good stuff. Um, so yeah, that's what I got. Thanks so much for watching.